Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of The Boogeyman. I am Artsy Gamer, here to bring you some smiles, and let's get this show on the road. I have absolutely don't remember what I was doing. I have a rope. Can I use the rope? Okay, I can't remember what I was doing. Oh yeah, there was this thing in our music box key. Fireworks. Did I get the key? I think I did. Yeah, I think I already got it. So now what? Start to something. I think. No, I guess not. Going in there? Oh, okay. Found it! Can't I? Well, uh. Don't tell me you're afraid. Oh, this is a dog. This wild dog chased me around for like an hour. <laughs> That's traumatizing. For such a big guy, you're really a whip. Oh, don't be mean now. Okay, well, I'm gonna save before I actually go in there. Okay, let's go. Ah, jeez, never mind. Ooh. Oh. All I want to... There is a... What? He, oh, here is a ringtone. I don't want to hear the ringtone. Hmm. Okay, then. You're more <gasps> yes. than I thought, David. Is he behind there? Don't 
like. Let's go. Jesus. Your mother's crying down in hell, you know. Oh man. More with the taunting. More Can't with the taunting. Can't you hear your mother's pitiful wails? Oh my God, why? Why did my dear Davy leave me alone? I don't want to be alone. Please don't leave me alone. Davy, oh Davy. <laughs> Calm down. Don't listen to him. David, doesn't it hurt leaving your mother all by oh herself? God. A real thoughtful son. He'd go to be by her side right away. No, or he wouldn't. you feel relieved? Well, not... To hell with that weak woman who always clung to you. Well, if this... If I'm correct and this is after, um... You know, this could be before the crooked man. So she might still be in the nursing home, so I don't even know if this is before or after. Whoa! Let go. I won't let him talk like that! Settle down. Don't open that door. Let go! You stupid brat! You don't listen to a word, do you? Shit. Never listens, never learns. Must have put your old man through a lot of trouble. What's that? I said your father must have had it real hard. Oh Come from danger alone. Following when I tell you to stay, if that's not being a brat, I don't know what is. Sleep with me one more time. It was not just your eyes that are fuzzy, but your ears too, or is it your head to blame? Getting riled up over every little thing. I think punching me will calm you down. Then go ahead. What? No? Okay. Let's go. Okay then. Watch, it was booby trapped. Climbing up these stairs are weird. Her majority. Can I use this key thingy? No. Okay, well, it's an iron door, so. what happens I use this oh I knew it well what if I move to the side huh. let's try that again oh no okay so what is this? Okay, I can't do that. I don't want to do that, so... I think I can dodge that. Can't? I can't even, like, fire axe? No. Ugh. Okay. This iron door... I can't use that. No. How about that? No. Okay. I don't know what to do now. Oh, that's not working though. Okay. That's it. Oh my god, I don't know what to do. I'm gonna go see if I can move to the side with that other thingy. Probably can't, but worth a shot. Watch me actually kill like David or something. Focus. Oh, prefer to see him dying a painful death. I was stuck in the door that was attacking his monkey attached. Take the key. And run like a bitch. Okay. Save. 
guys are so wonky. Okay. I use this key. Yeah. You did what? Hey, Whoa. David. Okay. What are you looking up at? Look down below. Damn. Ah, I finally got you snared. That detective okay. was a bit too perceptive earlier. Killing you would put me at a big advantage. A critical hit to the detective. Oh, this is getting good. Oh, shit. Yes. Exactly. This may sting a bit, David, but not wow. at all. That's a slow death. Now hurry, Batman. The Robin's gonna be a canary. Those are seriously wonky. through the floor so I'd be over here, right? he was or any of that crap okay um it's not over there so I don't know where he would be Seems not that right there Hey there, David. What are you looking up at? Look down below. Damn! Ah, I finally got you snared. That detective was a bit too perceptive earlier. Killing you would put me at a big advantage. A critical hit to the detective. Oh, this is getting good. <sighs> Uh, 
shirt. Okay, well, I'm super confused.
so lost. God, I'm so lost. Okay, let's try this again.
I love some one fudge. So confused. Oh, I got farther. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, huh. Let's try that again. That wasn't too bad. I got a little bit farther. I mean, I don't know what it did to help, but okay.
What are you doing? Oh shit. You can do this. Just walk. Hey. <coughs> <coughs> David! 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 Oh, I killed him. Oh, I did. Oh, I did the wrong one. No, I did the wrong one. I did bad. I did bad. Game over. Or is I it want bad? an enemy. Oh no. got those all over the place. Ain't the guy who just shot you in the head an enemy? Everyone you ever had to shoot was one too. They're all fakes. They're all smiles. I want an enemy. One that if I could kill them, would put an end to all these stupid incidents. Well, there's one of those. In here. Aim a shot in there, and you could kill him. Of course, it'd be a victory for you, but it'd be a loss, too. So you just gotta put up with all these small-minded guys instead. <sighs> We're almost at the hospital. Hope it's not too crowded. I killed him. I'm so confused. Why are you smiling? No. Uh. another playthrough where I have David again, but this is depressing. Killed him! Ah. And thank God. Don't elk. Act like you didn't know. It's just the way it goes. Yeah, fuck you. Stop it! It's my son. 
Oh my Are god. You sure? He's wearing the clothes from this morning. My wife showed his name on them. It's Todd Berry. Check behind him next. You have my deepest condolences. Damn. Sign here. We'll send you a pamphlet for a mortician. Refer to it if you wish. Thank you. There's a nurse waiting outside. Tell them if you need any help. Now, please excuse me. Somewhere. You gotta hurry. The suspect's on the move. Head for Don't go. Stay with me. Wow. face. A glare like that. Heck, it even gets me shaking. What got you so angry? Ah, David's death, perhaps? Well, there's no need to worry there, because I'm the one who killed him. It wasn't your fault. Oh yes, God. those are the magic words. Aren't they the ones you're always telling yourself every time you confront an innocent person's death? It's not my fault. <laughs> well, find my me, detective. You're always biting off more than you can chew, eh? But now you should be asking yourself, is it because this guy's a murderer that I want to kill him so bad? Whoa there. I know you want to make this quick, but give me a sec. Indeed. Once this game is over, you can leave safe and sound. With your wife, too. Yes, your wife is just fine. Well, maybe a little hurt, you know. If you catch me, this oh-so-fun game will finally end. But that's too boring, isn't it? Now, I'm going to kill you. Oh, great. You can put up any opposition you like. Nobody to force yourself to protect here. So do as you please. Kill me. Find your wife and go back home. That's a happy ending for you, right? I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Oh. Really? Don't do that. Precious box of yours. S it smells rotten. There's a corpse in the box. You're just pretending you don't notice it. 
so confused. that was like a wife or something. I have gone to the dark side. This is bad end, right? It's gonna be bad end. I feel like this is a bad end because I lost it. Sorry, I couldn't protect you. Continue our conversation. I'm gonna go with D, the bad one. Give me a week. I'll pack my bags. No, I'll leave. Oh my god, that's a bad ending. You should stay there. You don't want to let go of the house, do you? All the memories there. A week from now, let's do dinner. I want to talk about some last things. A lot of them. Okay, I want that too. No more beer for you? Yeah, I get sleepy if I drink too much. I'm I'll so take you confused. Home so you don't have to worry about that. No, it's fine. I need to be capable of going home alone, even if I'm drunk. Hey. Do you remember this? One time, after having a lot to drink, you came home with all this food. And when you got home, you started cooking all of a sudden. I just stared in disbelief while you cooked without a word. Then you said, Okay, eat up, good night, and fell asleep. Did that really happen? <laughs> of course! I couldn't eat it all, so I gave it to you in the morning. And you said, Oh, wow, luxurious. Did you make that in advance? You didn't remember it at all. Gosh, I laughed so hard. Oh my god, so cheesy. <laughs> the voice acting so bad. If you think that's funny, I shouldn't tell you what I got up to as a drunk student. You laughed yourself to death. I haven't seen you laughing. Really? If you can smile like that. I don't mean anything else. Not even me being with you? Ouch. Sorry. I'll stop. Don't cry, Helena. I want our last meeting to be a fun one. Right. Whoa. Zana not tell me about it. 
I want to talk. Please, call me back ASAP. I'm waiting. Oh, he resigned. <coughs> from Mr. Anderson? So he called the home phone too. Oh, you surprised me. Where were you? Couldn't sleep, so I thought I'd have a drink. Sorry I woke you. Though there was a bottle of spirits in here. Where'd that go? Oh, it's single straw. Keith? Whoa. Whoa. Aw, dude. Helena, you should stay in this house. Oh my lord. Shit just got real. Todd is here. And so am I. This was a bad ending. <laughs> this house looks like a box full of treasures to me. Treasures more valuable than life itself. I want to protect them at all costs. But I wasn't strong enough. I couldn't protect them. Not Todd. Not you. And yet, even knowing my powerlessness, I couldn't let them go. If you're ever born again, I'll pray, even if it means me. all the time I have for today guys and that was very um, gruesome so that's what happens if you uh, don't take that curtain so I will replay that and uh, get the other ending hopefully and yeah well it was fun I guess and I will uh, do another playthrough tomorrow with a good ending hopefully Anyway, I, I, I will uh, see you guys in the next video. Bye!